Prolonged exposure therapy was developed by Dr. Edna Foa at the Center for the Treatment and Study of Anxiety in Philadelphia. Research has shown prolonged exposure to be one of the most effective treatments for PTSD and has literally transformed this clinical care. I think one of the main points that we have to discuss with patients who are considering prolonged exposure therapy is this idea that you're going to go through short-term pain for long-term gain. In 2007, the VA launched a national initiative of prolonged exposure clinician training workshops, implementing Dr. Foa's work into the veterans' health system. National trainers of prolonged exposure therapy from the Minneapolis VA provide training for clinicians, consultants, interns, and residents locally and across the country. Following these workshops, one-on-one -on -one partnerships between consultant and clinician are formed and provide a full year of mentoring on prolonged exposure therapy. Most clinicians that we consult with are astounded by the results that they get within their work. Oftentimes they'll speak about veterans who they've been working with for years who really haven't responded to the, um, the treatment approaches they've been employing up until that point and then notice significant drops in both symptoms and improvement in overall quality of life. I did a pretty good job of maintaining a family and providing, but I had these thoughts. It, it got unbearable to where uh, I thought of in, in my life because it was so strong, and then I knew it was time <clears throat> to really get help. With prolonged exposure therapy, veterans repeatedly work through their painful memories, first under the guidance of a therapist, and then by confronting stressful and avoided daily life situations. As memories become less powerful over time, veterans experience less distress and achieve greater control over the symptoms of PTSD. I put myself in the middle of a crowd uh, which, was, of course, was very uneasy. It was something that I didn't particularly like to do. But then I faced it. And I could think myself through that situation. Of course, then life got better. It's like the, the, the difference between day and night. You know, it's, uh, it's so strong.